The Chamber has long advocated for the development of the Cotton Belt commuter rail line that connects Richardson and Plano to DFW Airport and on to downtown Fort Worth. Last Tuesday night, the DART board voted 12 to 3 to approve their 20-year financial plan, which includes the funding plan for development of the Cotton Belt. This is a major victory that we have been waiting for for many, many years. In fact, in 1983, when Richardson joined DART and it was created, the Cotton Belt was on the plan and it was projected at that time it would start by 2010. Well, now we've got a plan that's been voted on by the board that will deliver that service by 2022. This is huge for our businesses and huge for our communities because it gives us kind of that other transportation linkage that we have long sought that will complement our dark red line, our US 75 and Bush 190 and 635 that give us this great access in and out of Richardson and the great reach that our employers have to an employment base around the North Texas region. So Cotton Belt uh, will have uh, two stations at least in Richardson, one at City Line and one at uh, UT Dallas. And uh, it looks like the trains will run initially about every 30 minutes and it'll have a direct connection into DFW Airport. And so this is uh, great news for us. Uh, Mayor, former Mayor Gary Slagle, who is on the DART board, was a key leader in this. Uh, we had key leaders uh, from our chamber who testified uh, before uh, the DART uh, board, including our Chairman Ken Hutchinarder, our Vice Chair Martin Malloy, uh, myself, and in fact, I co-signed a letter uh, with the presidents of the Plano and Metro Crest Chambers of Commerce uh, advocating for funding uh, for the Cotton Belt. Uh, this came despite uh, a lot of opposition uh, from some uh, uh, groups in Dallas uh, that did not want to see the Cotton Belt uh, prioritized, uh, but we were able to uh, convince the DART board that they could fund all their transportation needs, including a new subway line in downtown Dallas, uh, trolley lines, and expansion of bus service in one big package. So the next steps are that uh, DART already has funding to do uh, the engineering work uh, for the Cotton Belt uh, since they already own the line and uh, they will then begin looking at where to place the exact stations, uh, the grade crossings, et cetera, uh, the buffers around uh, the neighborhoods, et cetera. And they will also be applying for a uh, loan from the uh, Federal Railroad Federal Railroad Administration uh, at the great interest rate of prime plus one basis point. Uh, we'd all like to have that kind of interest rate. So uh, things will be moving and uh, the kind of vehicle that they're going to use on this commuter line is similar to what uh, the Denton Transportation Authority uses, which is a very quiet vehicle, uh, but it is a commuter rail line, which is different than the, uh, the dark red line and the kind of vehicle that they use yet there. So uh, this is a huge milestone in our city's uh, history. Uh, again, a great new transportation linkage that will come in, into Richardson and connect us uh, with uh, DFW Airport, and your chamber played a big role in it.